I'm Andrew Edelston, an AI Engineering Director in the NVIDIA Developer Technologies team. These are the three most important things to understand about NVIDIA DLSS. Number three, DLSS, or Deep Learning Super Sampling, uses the power of AI to boost frame rates in games with graphically intensive workloads. For instance, when we look at the next-gen visuals in 3D Mark's Port Royale, we see that even NVIDIA RTX GPUs with their RT cores can struggle with the benchmark's extreme content. By enabling DLSS, which leverages Turing's tensor cores, we have a much higher and more consistent frame rate. Number two, the NVIDIA research team invented DLSS, but adding it to a game required extreme optimization of the model and experimenting with different layer types, input sizes, and training techniques. Going from research to production was a big step, during which we learned a ton and added layers of automation to our Saturn V supercomputing cluster. Number one, DLSS is an exciting example of things to come. Deep learning has been in the cloud for several years, but DLSS is the first time we've put real-time deep learning into a game. This is just the tip of the spear. Over the next few years, we may well see games with text-to-speech, speech-to-text, actual AI for bots, deep learning-driven dynamic materials and animation systems, and 50 other things we haven't even considered yet. It's going to be awesome, so start thinking today about how you will use deep learning in your next game. If you're attending GDC 2019, come and learn more about DLSS, how DLSS was integrated in Battlefield 5, and deep learning for games and graphics during our GDC session.